Four fast facts about new First Lady Dr. Chpomot Spramifosa. Here's all you need to know about your new First Lady. Like her husband, Dr. Mott Spramifosa is a fiercely private person. But what we do know is that she's a mum to four children, two sons and two daughters, and her heart is as big as her business and academic accomplishments. She's a medical doctor by training. A graduate of the University of KwaZulu-Natal, Mott Spramifosa is a qualified medical doctor who has worked in both public and private hospitals. She also completed her Master of Public Health in Maternal Child Health and Aging at Harvard University's School of Public Health. She also holds a Social Entrepreneurship Program Certificate from the Gordon Institute of Business Science. She's a philanthropist. She became a sponsor of Rodin High School pupil got that some factor hearing her story when she offered her a lift home. The daughter to a domestic worker, Mott Spramifosa bought her a cell phone and has over the past five years tried to help bridge the gap between her humble beginnings and her elite school. I call her Madame because she is like a mother to me. Everything I need, I can simply call her and she is there for me. I remember she used to pay for my bus fees before I moved into the boarding school, Moff was quoted saying in a News 24 report. She's a member of one of SIS's most influential black families. She is the sister of mining magnate and SIS dollar billionaire Patrice Motts, as well as formidable businesswoman Bridge Raby, who was the first black woman to own a major mining company in SIS. Bridget is married to minister in the presidency Jeff Raby. Her father is the late Chief Augustine Butanikin Motts, who was also a mining magnate in his own right and former owner of Mamlo Dyson Downs. She's passionate about children's education, Mott Spramifosa has been involved, as a patron or board member, in a number of NPOs that are focused on advancing education opportunities for the youth. She's the chairperson of the African Self-Help Trust and a former board member of the Student Sponsorship Program. She's also the patron for the South African Civil Society for Women's Adolescents and Children's Health.